The Tunisian government has called for dialogue between all stakeholders to limit the spread of violence inside and outside stadiums. The call for extreme violence has become usual at stadiums. The Premier's office is working closely with the Tunisian Football Federation, the Ministry of Youth and Sports, the Interior and Justice Ministries, and all state apparatuses to stop this dangerous phenomenon. Some recent footage shocked the public with growing violence between fans and support groups, especially youths. There's a lack of trust between the state and support groups who often transform the stadium into a battleground. Spectator violence has invaded stadiums in the whole region. Youth are oppressed, isolated or unemployed. This feeling nurtures violence. Security experts reveal that hundreds of athletes and active members in support groups have joined terrorist organizations in conflict zones. The violence has metamorphosized into religious extremism. Many fans and fan leaders, as well as elite athletes from the national taekwondo team and footballers took arms and joined wars abroad. This is not limited to Tunisia. According to the Interior Ministry, violence often takes place between fans of the same team or target security forces and destroy public property. Tunisian teams call for strict measures to limit this scourge. The Tunisian Football Federation plans to step up efforts to ban dozens of fans from entering stadiums. These young people are responsible for the eruption of violence and the aggression of spectators and policemen. Adnan Shawishi, CGTN, Tunis.